All right, Tucker Sargent joins me now, and Tattnall had a tough yeah. home opener tonight, Tuck, with a top team in single A. Yes. As Sly County was in making to play the Trojans. Yeah, Sly County, I learned that pronunciation just <laughs> recently. They went 10-2 and two a year ago, and yeah, the AJC had the Wildcats ranked first in the new Division II in single A, heading into this new season. First ever meeting between these two programs, by the way. One of the night's only games to actually start on time. There's that rainbow again, it was beautiful. Nothing more beautiful than a rainbow over a high school football stadium, baby. Trojans started this one hot, opening kickoff, a big return from Anton Johnson. This kid's an athlete, he's only a sophomore, running back and defensive back, kick returner too. He's into Sly County territory to start the season. First play from scrimmage, Tattnall's Ross Kerbo. Heaves one deep to Mario Wilmore is there. And the Trojans are threatening already against the top ranked team. A few plays later, Cameron Person, big boy, rumbles his way into the end zone. Tattnall up 7-0 after the extra point. Less than three minutes in. Sly with it now, across 50 on its opening drive. Jay Kanazawa complete to Sam Forehand, but he loses the ball. It's a gift for Reggie Troutman, who actually also knocked it out. He recovers it, and Tattnall's going the other way. But it didn't last long. Trojans give it right back to the Wildcats with a fumble of their own a few plays later. Sly unable to score, though. To the second quarter we go. Still 7-0 Tattnall. Anton Johnson, another big play for the home team, goes up and gets one there. And the Trojans are back in the red zone. Eventually they'd make their way to the end zone again. It is Person again. High snap, but there he goes. Touchdown, Tattnall Square, his second score of the night. Wild Trojan score, man, he's big. 14-0 Tattnall after the kick. Sly would finally score on its next drive and then with one second on the clock before half, they strike again. One-handed grab for Jalewis Solomon as time expires. Tattnall not happy that the Wildcats got that second back. The extra point was blocked. 14-13 the score there. First play of the third quarter. Here comes Sly. Screen pass. Forehand doesn't drop this one. He does drop several defenders. Tattnall can't get him down. And yeah, he's in there for the score. And the number one team's first lead of the night. They also got a two-point conversion despite being backed up with a penalty. Look at this grab. Mm. Wildcats up 21 to 14 there. Tattnall didn't fold though. Scored again, but the final in this one, Sly County 28 to 21. Final score. Tough loss for the Trojans after playing the number one Cats close, but what a what a night to build on going into uh, another former Middle Georgia coach Dwight Jones and St. Ann Pacelli next week.